Hi pals! I'm back in San Diego with another vlog. So obviously it's Friday. I was actually unsure if I wanted to actually vlog today or not. Just because I've been feeling kind of down this week actually, like in a weird way. I'm gonna be real with y'all because I think everyone should be like real on the internet. So basically I just got back from my like three week long trip to Illinois and Mexico back to san diego on monday it's now friday and on monday i felt really anxious like sunday scaries but on a monday if you know what i mean and then today i started feeling like the same way like i just like have never felt like that before and i don't know why like even when i first moved here like i never really felt lonely anxious like really didn't have bad emotions like yeah i miss my family and my boyfriend but like i was still doing good and then i just like i don't know it's been weird lately and could be also something to do with new birth control and a combination of whatever but so today i had to take lolly to the vet um to check up on her teeth she's doing okay she'll need a dental in a couple months but i'm gonna wait on that because they're totally fine for now and then because I was feeling weird, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna take her to Mission Beach and walk the boardwalk. And I am so glad I did because I needed it so much. Like it made me feel a million times better. I do that all the time. I think it's also like, I love working from home, but sometimes like you just need that like human interaction. And even on the days I go into the office here, like I kind of don't feel any better because I don't really know anyone there and they're like all older than me. So I feel like I have to like actually get out and like, just do something outside more so. So literally just like waving to strangers and like talking about my dog to people like made me feel so much better and being in the fresh air on the beach walking. But I didn't start the vlog then because I'm an idiot. And then I watched the sunset at Sunset Cliffs with Lolly. And then I just ate dinner and Allie's actually on her way home from work right now. And I think we're just gonna hot tub tonight and have like a girls night. I don't know if we're inviting anyone over. We both like kind of felt weird today, just like had off days. So like we both wanted to just like relax in the hot tub, which is perfect for me. And then tomorrow there's like plans up in the air. There's a brew fest in San Diego that one of our friends is trying to get us free tickets into. But I guess it might also be like postponed or he might not be working it anymore. I don't know. So those plans are like eh, iffy. Hi! Okay, it's the next day, so it's Saturday. We've actually had like kind of a busy morning. It's already like one yeah. o'clock. We woke up this morning and met a friend for brunch, I guess you would call it. We went to a coffee shop that was actually really cute. And of so course, cute. we got acai bowls. We're obsessed. Course, They're basic. so good. We are really basic. <laughs> that one was really good. My favorite's the place that I work at, but um, I think the, like the, what really set apart was the honey. Yeah, I really oh. do taste the honey, but this one didn't have peanut butter. Yeah, I don't, I don't like the peanut butter. I don't oh, like I do. Well, oh, I don't like when it's chunky, it. but I like when it's drizzled. Okay, drizzled is different. <laughs> That's like, okay, we're like- I know, we're going on about us at Evils. <laughs> anyway, okay, that was fun. We tried to thrift shop, but it was just like not, I don't know, I feel like it you have to be like out. really 100% in the mood. Yeah, work. you do. And we weren't, like we were kind of excited, but not excited enough. So we're it was like, like- we're there. We looked, we left. No options. I'll try again probably next weekend. I don't know, I've been wanting to do it, but like I also like when I'm wearing like real clothes, I don't want to try anything on. I have to be wearing like a comfy t-shirt to like, yeah, like be motivated to change. Outfit. Oh, I feel that. Exactly. Like easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now we're actually going to a brew fest um, because it's free. I think the tickets are actually worth like $60, but our friend, the same one we went to coffee with, um, is supposed to be working at an event there. His like booth got canceled. The, like, awesome. like, he's literally like the best connection because he got He's to, like, so nice. Okay. Shout okay. out to Griffin. Yeah, literally. There was one time our Uber was like, and me and Tiana shit on it. We're like, no. We're like, F, no, we hate country. Griffin calls me up, hey, thought of you because you're from Michigan. I was like, I'm offended, but thank you. Yeah, I'm definitely offended that you thought I like country just because I'm from the Midwest. <laughs> <laughs> but we ended up going because it was free. And it was yeah. actually such a good time. We met some fun time. people, yeah. yeah. Um, so that's kind of our mindset today. We're like, you know what, we might as well go. And I really do like beer. Allie has to work later, so she can't go like full out. Full hard, <laughs> full send it. Right, right, but, but you know, still. I'm gonna stab her a little bit, because <laughs> beer is the best part. Yeah. Especially like San Diego, like they got a lot of food. There's so many breweries around here, and I like actually truly love craft beer, so I'm pumped. It yeah, is a little more chilly than I would like it to be today, but yeah, we're in like long, long sleeves and jeans. And, jeans. and hats. Jeans. That's and supposed hats. to keep the warm in. <laughs> yeah, literally keep the Look at us. Warm. We're like proud of our outfits. Yeah. Fashionistas. <laughs> like okay, shit. we've been talking forever. See you there. Bye. This is not a foot. This is like seven inches max, maybe eight. Oh my God. Okay, the 
Summerfest was actually so fun. I had so many good beers. My favorite one was from like Bayside Brewery. I think it was a coconut flavor. Band, rockin'. Like 80s, 90s music, perfect. Only thing is I'm pretty cold, um, but I'm always cold and I can't complain because I literally live in California, so. 65 is better than like 32, probably 22 actually in Illinois right now, so. Now I'm going home to see Lolly and make some food. Back home with the babies. <laughs> um, it's 7 p.m. and I just woke up from an hour nap and I don't know if I can go back out. I kind of have a headache, like I'm a little bit hungover from the beer fest thing. Day drinking is weird, man. I ate a frozen burrito that I had when I first got home and then I just now ate a PB&J too. <laughs> And I really just want to lay down and watch Netflix. Like, I don't want to put makeup on again. <sighs> decisions, decisions. What a struggle. Good morning. It's Sunday now. I definitely didn't end up going back out last night. I probably could have. Like, I really didn't feel shitty. I was just kind of tired. But I, like, also didn't feel like getting re-ready and, like, I don't know. On the bright side, I am not hungover today and I am ready to go. I'm about to go to the gym to start off my day. Probably just gonna walk to show and run slash walk. <laughs> I'm not really feeling the weights today. And then I need to go to the farmer's market. I like entered an Instagram contest on accident actually. <laughs> For those of you that don't know, I not only have a personal Instagram, but I also have like a vegan food Instagram just to share my food and show that vegans don't just eat salads and vegetables. We have a lot of fun meals that we can have. And so I posted a picture of these tacos from a farmer's market a while back. And I guess they were like actually running an Instagram contest for those that post pictures of their food. So I actually won. <laughs> and so now they're giving me a Dutch oven, which I didn't know what that was. I thought that a Dutch oven was when someone farts and puts a blanket over your head. But apparently it's a nice big pot. So don't know what I'll use it for, but it's free. So I might as well go pick it up. And then I'll probably have some time to chill after. I don't know what I'll end up doing. And then I'm babysitting tonight for a family that I love. So I'm excited to see them tonight and that will wrap up my weekend. Okay, I definitely had a slow moving morning, but kind of like on purpose. I hate rushing and I love when I have like all the time in the world to do whatever I want. So after I worked out, I showered. I did a little bit of stretching outside literally in my PJs with some coffee. Then I got ready and now I'm finally going to the farmer's market at 11.30. It's only like 10 minutes away though, so it'll be a quick trip, but I totally expected to be there by like 10.30, so technically I'm running a little bit behind of my expectations, but don't actually have to be anywhere at a certain time besides babysitting at literally four, so we Gucci. So I started doing this thing where I carry my like writing journal with me everywhere so that if I ever feel like journaling, I am ready. So I went straight from the farmer's market to Ocean Beach. You can't really see the water because this like sand is like super high. I don't really understand it. I guess it happens this time of year, whatever. But I'm sitting on like a grass area right behind the water to a journal. I have Lolly with me. She's just chilling and laying down behind me. I'm only gonna write a couple pages, I think. The one mushroom taco from Fave Tacos didn't hold me over. So I made a coffee cup full of cereal, which is my favorite way to eat it and sitting outside. I have been laying outside <laughs> on our patio for like over an hour now, but it's nice and relaxing. Okay, I just packed Lolly and I's dinner for the babysitting place tonight. And yes, most babysitters here actually let me take Lolly along, which is super nice because I don't wanna leave her for like six hours at home while I'm babysitting. Well, plus the drive, so it's like seven hours I'm gonna be gone. A shout out to the cool parents out there. Anyway, I don't think there's gonna be anything fun for me to share. I would feel uncomfortable videotaping someone's kid tonight. And honestly, I'll just come home and go to sleep after I'm sure because I do have work in the morning super early, which means I'm gonna end this vlog here. As always, I really appreciate all of your guys' support. Thank you for watching and I will see you next video. Love you, bye.